Taylor, can you even start to put into words how you feel right now? Um, yeah, I can. I'm buzzing, to be honest. You know, it's even better after the uh, hard pre-season. It's just nice to get the reward at the end of it. Did you have a feeling, because you've been involved so much in pre-season, not just doing training, but out on the pitch with the lads as well? Um, not really, to be honest. But uh, when I've been training, I think I've been doing quite well. So just please have uh, impressed the gaffer. Just a few days ago when it started to be a real indication that this was on the cards, how did you start to feel? Um, I didn't know what to think really, to be honest. I just carried on as normal, <laughs> training-wise. Two-year deal, Taylor, that's massive. It, it, a lot you can get in, your teeth into. Yeah, I, um, I feel I can really push on in these two years now. What's it done for your confidence? Uh, I've always been quite confident when it comes to football, but yeah, it's upped it a bit. So hopefully I can keep on pushing. Basically, basically what it says is that the, that the manager believes in what it is that you're doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's good that he's, uh, he's got faith in the young lads. Uh, it gives us a real chance to impress and progress as a player. You watched it happen with Jared. You watched yeah. it happen with Josh Dixon and Kieran as well. It, it, that must give you the feeling that, hey, I want a bit of that. Yeah, well, once you see them out there doing what they're doing, you just want to be there as well. So it gives you uh, the oomph to try and impress as well. For those fans who haven't seen much of Taylor Charters, what, how would you describe yourself as a player? Uh, attacking midfielder, I like to get on the ball, create stuff, and I like to work hard in defence as well. And you like to score a goal, you've got yeah, some yeah. beauties under your belt so far. <laughs> yeah, well, it's always nice to help with the goal, but there's a lot of other things that I can help to get the team three points in the day. You've got your contract, what sort of things has the manager said about what he wants to see next? He wants to see me keep on pushing, try and get into the first team in a few years. Slightly frustrating that you still got your scholarship yeah. to finish. <laughs> well, not really. Uh, it's fine. It, you know, I signed a free, so yeah. This is what a year and a bit ago, Taylor. This is what the aim was. Once you yeah. came through the academy, get this done, get the contract. What does it feel to have achieved? To have achieved? Oh, unreal. To be honest, I can't really put into words. To be honest, yeah. Mum and Dad are here. What are they saying, and how proud yeah. are they? They're very proud. They've put a lot of hard work into getting me to sessions. Over the eight, eight years I've been with the club, so yeah, proud. Massive first hurdle that you've got over. Next one is to get yourself a starting place in that team, and that has to be the aim. Yeah, it's been hard work to get to here, but it doesn't stop now. It gets even harder, you know. Just keep on trying to improve. Is there just a little bit of you that wants to be in Hungary right now with the rest of the lads? Yeah, uh, well, they're sunning up while we're training, so a little bit, but you know, it's always good to get back uh, with the first team, get involved with them because it improves you as a player as well. Super, thanks for your time, Tim.